Hello again everyone, welcome to a new video. In this video we have a kids digital camera uh, targeted at children aged 3 to 8. It's 8 megapixels, it's shock proof, it has 4.4 star rating out of 5, it has 248 orders and it cost me around $18 which is around 12 quid in the UK. I paid via PayPal and it arrived in around 13 days I think it was. As you can see, it's already open. I didn't know what it was when it came, so I opened it up. As you can see, it's bubble wrapped. As you can see, there's the camera and the box that comes in, which is intact, but a little bit dented. Sometimes that is a problem if you're buying it as a gift, you don't really want it to come. You, you want it to come perfect, but they often don't. Uh, video capture, photo capture, connect to your computer. Built-in rechargeable battery and expandable memory. It doesn't come with an SD card and you'll have to, but well you can buy one from the same seller or just provide your own. I've got my own here. And I think it's a maximum, it takes a maximum 32 gigabytes, I think. You can see we have a, a strap, a carry strap, a USB charging cable, and you'll be able to connect that to your PC as well. The camera itself, as you can see, is quite small. You have an on button, obviously these are buttons for the menu, picture, settings button. Um, so, there we go. It's recording, taking pictures. That button there must be so you can scroll through your images. Slot for the SD card. Just going to place that in. There we go. And we have the USB cable slot there. So, there was no charge in it, so as you can see, we've got it on charge now. And we'll leave that a little while and then um, we'll have a see how it works, take a few pictures. Got it plugged into my mini PC there, as you can see. That light indicates that it is charging. I'm not sure if that the, the colour of the light will change when it's fully charged, but we'll not wait till it's fully charged, we'll just charge up a bit and then um, we'll get it get it tested out. Okay, so we've got it charged up. And something I need to mention that I realised um, while I was charging it is that earlier in the video I called it eight megapixels, um, an eight megapixel camera. I've checked the listing and it does say eight megapixels on the sales page. In fact, it says it in the title. Um, but when I've clicked on another seller of the same thing, he states that it's a 0 0.9 megapixel camera. Now I've already took some photos with this. And looked at them on my computer, and that's why I went to check this, uh, the seller's listing because they're, they're not very clear. I'll put them on the screen um, towards the end of this video so you can see for yourself. Because no one in the reviews, um, they're all saying how great this camera is, but no one's actually put any pictures that they've taken on the. They've just put pictures of the camera or a picture of the child holding the camera, but they haven't actually shown anybody the actual pictures that it takes. Um, I'll, put them, I'll, I'll put on screen for you the pictures I have taken outside and uh, you can judge for yourself. But yeah, as you can see, when you turn it on, you met with this menu, you'll use the, I think that's called a shutter button, to choose what you want and you'll use these arrows. As you can see, you'll probably notice there, um, so yeah, every time I want to choose one, click the um, button. You have games on here, Snake. Um, push the box, never heard of it. Some sort of maze game. Another one, another one. Then back to snakes, so that's about five games, I think. Um, I have to go backwards, we press the power button. I'll take it back to the menu. You can put music on your SD card and play music. Obviously, you can take videos. Um, this is where we can look at the pictures we took which, viewing it on the camera itself, they look alright. 
they don't look too bad. And we'll come back off that. Oh yeah, something else you can do by the way. I'm going to push up, choose the camera mode. Is on the right here. If you no, that's wrong actually. The up and down buttons when you're in camera mode. If you press them, they'll go through some frames that you can use. And uh, that's pretty much it really. There's not a lot to it. I mean we have some basic settings. The video is not 1080p, I can promise you that. <clears throat> Sorry if I sound a little groggy. I've not been very well lately. Um, so yeah. Um, So purely as a child's camera, um, it's pretty good. It is, I mean, it's light, but it's solid. Seems to be well made. And a kid, you know, especially a young kid, will um, really enjoy using it. Uh, I mean, one megapixel is not great, but honestly, I've I've had expensive VTEC um, cameras, and them Im images are not great either. Um, especially the ones, the the smaller ones. Um, so yeah, I have a three year old boy who I'll give this to and um, I'm sure he'll enjoy it, he'll take lots of pictures um, so yeah, there'll be links in the description if you want to check it out I won't be linking to the seller I bought this from because he's dishonestly put 8 megapixels in the title of his sales page so I'll, I'll post a link to a more honest seller uh, with more reviews, better reviews so you can check it out um, so yeah, thanks for watching, I'll uh, put some images on the screen now of what I've took so you can see for yourself, and I'll see you in another video, bye.